Yes, hello, 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 guys. Welcome back to Coding with Genesis. And this time I'll be showing you how to use LaTeX on phones. The LaTeX editor is there available on phones, and you can typeset your documents very, very well using your phone. So I'm gonna first start by if you don't have the app, you're gonna head to Play Store. I'm gonna look for my Play Store, Google Play Store. Google Play Store is there. So I'm gonna search for an app called Vaptex. It's called Vab Vaptex. Vaptex. Something like that. Vaptex Vertex. Something like that. Sorry about that. So the app is called Vaptex Latex Editor and it's only 2 MBs, like 2 MBs. So I will go and open my Vaptex and here they are saying update don't know if mine is updated so it will install my verbtex app is here so if i open verbtex it usually comes with local mode and cloud mode we shall be majorly working in the local mode cloud mode if you go on cloud mode you see later if you go on cloud mode cloud mode sorry about that i'm sorry the app is updating yes cloud mode this is the basic layout for Vaptex and then cloud mode. Cloud mode is for those who have accounts, you can either go and register. Your projects will be saved on the cloud so that you can retrieve them anywhere it will be. And that is the best option. But then that I will show you how to register later. So I will first use the local mode. If I'm using the local mode, I'll go here and they'll ask me a project name. So I will just say document one, doc one. That will be my project name and then below here on the add button i'll add so they will say document one formed they form for you the files so if i click in document one they will be like your document classes and article use packages these are the packages document begin and heading so if you want if you, if you know some part of latex you could either go here and select everything you select all and you delete so that you know what you are doing so i could start it usually has auto 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 generated packages i could start with now i make my document class i could start and i say document class document class it's an article yeah article it's an article we usually use the article part because it's easier to handle for class submissions and everything so i'm going to make a simple document you shall follow later and i show you how so i will just make my title i make a command for title what will be our title it's called document one so if you are doing a submission of a, a document you shall say document submission whatever so document one will be our title then i could also make a subtitle something about the document or you could say subtitle 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 i could put a subtitle as my university name subtitle muni university muni university uh -huh. then from the subtitle i could put my faculty i'm in the faculty of science faculty 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 is a command for usually like there are commands for faculty, authors, uh, you will search more. Subtitle is called Science and Technology. That's my subtitle. I could say Technology. Technology. Uh -huh. Now we are in, a, in, a, in an app called Vabtex. So I could. Who, who is the author? If you are writing a document, you should always have an author. Who is the author? Who are you? Who, who is writing the document? Author. Who is the author? Author. Author. It's called the Olise Genesis. I usually, usually say Olise Genesis at Study Uganda. Genesis at Study UG. That's my brand, Study Uganda Innovations UG. Wherever you can follow me. You could even follow us on studyuganda.com, studyug.com. So I will just begin my document. Begin document. 
it's here it's the command to begin a document begin uh -huh. now the document begins from there begin i've begun the document uh -huh. then what is in the document now i made the title everything on top so i will just bring this title and put it in the document using the command make title that's the command for putting the document into there so after making title i could put i after the title i could put a new line new line then below the new line what should i put let me put follow for more follow for more at studyug.com studyug.com here you could ask questions about latex and everything then what else could i put there i could make a bold statement i could make a bold text this is bold text bf text bf what is to be bolded text bf aha uh -huh. text bf you could also follow like subscribe to our youtube subscribe to this channel for more to this channel ah I end a simple document like that. So how do I close the document? I just come here and I say there I began the document. So here I will say end document. See the latex has the kind of syntax like the one of Ruby. So I will just say end document. Document. After ending my document, there you will have made a lot of things. Then you will come here on this app and say generate. Then it will say I'm generating your PDF. Wait. So um, here it's kind of so it's kind of slow. You see, it refused to generate the document saying this and this and this. So uh, uh, I go into my log files. I check. Usually you go here. Uh, if you generate a document and it refuses, you go here and see. So it says the package subtitle is not available so i will remove the subtitle is subtitle like in this in this package subtitle is not available so i will leave it oh i could use a package that allows subtitle and that package is called i could use a package called vib use package this one sets the paper to a4 those who have been do, doing books and everything use a sub a package called verb like this it's, it immediately sets the paper to A4. You don't need to do the margins and everything. So to reduce more and more, let me remove this subtitle. Moon University, I don't think I even wanted to put it there. So I remove the subtitle and I will generate. So it will say generating your PDF. Please wait. Ah, then they say that PDF could not be generated. So I will check the log file again. Let me first save our document. Uh, save then ah, I think I placed new document no then option is yeah sorry about that you see this latex editor ah, sorry 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 about this ah. Usually, the, 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 this editor comes with inbuilt preferences. They are the ones that allow you to move forward. So if I could go back here and to my verb text, then option is, then I save, then I leave it, then I go back to verb text, it's save here. Uh -huh. Then I close this document. Uh, so I will just go here. Uh, if i could start sorry about that let me first put this on yeah so guys i've done a few changes uh, i've done a few changes i could just say you remember what we had put there let me put there what is the genesis for some my text goes here let me put all this genesis today i make some paragraph we are we are working with the vertex on phones using we are using the latex verb app the verb text app it's called verb text verb text app 
ah, simple thing like that so i will just generate ah, i will generate my pdf if i say generate it just says downloading the pdf ah, so i will open my pdf i don't know if I, let me use this phonix browser it usually opens pdfs well ah, to load your plugin 14 percent uh, if you have another PDF viewer, you could open it from there. Ah. So you see how the document looks very well. Latex for mobile, main heading. Today we are working with Latex for phone. So if I could go back to my, this one. If I could go back to my verb text and you see, hash section, main heading. Usually the name your section is new names. Which section, hash section name. What is the main heading? Latex C for phones. For phones. Ah, there you could put there something else. You could put multiple signs and everything. Then I generate my my PDF to say generating. Please wait. Ah, loading a PDF. Then we keep, keep open. Ah, Latex for phones. Some beautiful document like this one. You see, you could use this app to do a lot of your classwork and practice makes perfect. I'll be bringing more how to use Latex now to make a full document, how to sign up for the Latex online app so that you keep getting your documents wherever you go. Thinking, guys, don't forget to subscribe. Um, all the Genesis, peace out. I'll keep adding more and more and more. Don't forget to follow the feed blog on you can follow on the on the way www.studyug.com or anywhere you could whatsapp you could follow our telegram channel and innovations ug as a bland thank you